Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Age of Petty Kingdoms, which is a relatively new little sub-mod. We've covered some of the beta for previously, but uh, I figured we'd do some episodes on this since it's quite popular. Uh, got tons of fucking factions, so I spent like the last 10 minutes figuring out what exactly we'd play. I did some footage with House Blackwood and we took over the North as Umber in a stream that I did a while back. Which, unfortunately, if you didn't watch the stream, you can't watch that. But, um, um, after thinking over it a bit, House Sunderland is being removed in the next patch that the mod creator is doing. Which I don't agree with. I think it's quite a nice little faction to play with lots of possibilities to conquer in any direction. It's kind of like having the Ironborn in the east, rather than the west. So, uh, yeah, we'll play as these guys because they're not going to be around forever. Which is sucky, but oh well, we'll play as them. Consider them the Ironborn, but like I said, in the east, which is pretty awesome as it is. But uh, we'll take, I think, the north, or at least we'll we'll burn the north and then attack the Vale, or something. I don't know. There's a lot of a uh, lot of opportunity. Like I said, we uh, we pretty much control the seas around the area, so it should be relatively easily done. But now uh, this mod is quite popular right now. I haven't had much time to play it, unfortunately, since I've been modding some own stuff of my own, but uh, I figured we'd get around to this now. It's <laughs> probably going to go into the too late playing this, and I'm going to regret it, but anyway. Sack of Wolf's Den. House Ashwood has ruled from the Wolf's Den for thousands of years, or at least they did until King Godric Sunderland took it from them in the night, wiping out the house in the process. With the system in arms raiding along the coastline, many lords have looked to the Boltons for protection. Others, however, see this as an opportunity for expansion as the Bolton are now are now away. As the Bolton are now away. There are some spelling errors in these scripts, and I suck at reading things. <laughs> With every nearby kingdom in the north eyeing for their lands, House Bolton must use all its strength and cunning to survive the coming months. Yes. And especially since you're screwing with me. Um we need to build up I mean, like literally we're raiders, pretty much. And Immediately, you need to move on these locations to get cash. I never like sailing anyway, my king. We do at the very least have an awesome born, general. Besieging the cowards, Malige. Patiently yeah, so we, we got slavers, and, and then well, the slavers suck. The archers are pretty decent, but the slavers are particularly shit. So we can't rely too heavily on them. They got really bad morale, which I hate. Actually, the slavers are okay, but if you you got slaves, which are like town militia, but they got really poor morale and everything, so we don't want to use them at all. For now, though, we'll take Ramsgate, raid along the western, uh, the northern coastline, just to get a bunch of cash and uh, fund our fund our little campaign, as it were. But we'll burn the north. As fuck all will stop us from doing so. Command me, sire. We shall slaughter them, my lord. Ah, victory! Nothing can stop us, sire. We don't get too much for the cash for sacking these things. Take the spoils of war. Set sail. Bringing the men ashore, sire. Should get more for sacking winners. Watch. For the very they least. Wish they'd never been born, sire. <laughs> <laughs> I've completely forgot. Uh, wall, we've got Old Castle, which is right there, Only that we've completely missed. Until the slaughter begins. So we need to swing back on ourselves and deal with that in a moment. There's nothing the Boltons can do to stop me from taking these locations right now. They just simply can't reach me to stop me. For a bit, at least, until they... Uh, until they run in more troops to their cause. Such is the fate of all who oppose us. Really not getting much in the way of Another loot when we take these places. Us. Victory. No point in taking those little areas. This has kind of halted our advance a little. I want to take Old Castle though, definitely. Because the Bolton armies aren't going to be on the way. Build that merchant just so we have a ship over there. Build two slavers at that point. The archers are going to be a big help, but the AI being the stupid ass AI, I tend to I haven't played like single player in quite some time. My people have a message for you. 
This agreement is a great news for my people. Has anyone else noticed that the Stark Princess sounds like a dude? Farewell. We hope all just, our just ignore that. <laughs> As well, this mod's nice, certainly for adding all of the fashions and everything, but I don't know. It, it still needs a lot of work, I think, to be on par with things like uh, the King of Rivers and Hills and everything. A fine day to sail. Yes, sir. Full sail. A fine day to sail. An order. Order. We can get on to land. Yes. Sire. Command me, sire. Just with the cavalry, but Your it's will, My lord. Fleet ready, it's... Sire. Some of these guys had orders. No? Okay, we can't. Orders. But we can simply do this if we leave some slaves behind. Yes, sire. By your will, sire, we shall engage. Ships ready. My lord. My king. Bringing the go. horde together behind me, sire. I'll do that for now. We are slowly going into debt, but that will fix itself eventually. Put some mercenary cogs there. These guys don't really like what you said. We can't recruit anything from these regions until we wipe out all of House Bolton. Evidently. We will split off our forces and fuck up some of the Vale as well. Like I said, we'll do this Ironborn style, which pretty much just means attacking everything on the coastline, sacking it, and then getting the fuck out of there. The North, at least, I want to try and focus around... Oops, Slum King is in Gardner of Mandel Alliance. Uh, yeah, the, the North at least I want to try and never been born, keep sire. what lands I can take. Victory! Nothing can Old stop Castle gave me some cash at least. The settlement has fallen. Take the spoils of fleet ready, sire. Disembarking, sire. We've got a full stack. Praise My the gods. <laughs> we we lost fifty-three slot. people killing that lot. Damn game. My king, command me, sire. Uh, I think we'll go by land for now. I mean, we're still we go no further today. slowly going into debt, but I'll move these gentlemen over in a moment. Uh, it's probably easier. Yeah, you've got mounted slavers. I want some cavalry, at the least. Aye, sire. Fleet ready, sire. Ships ready. Yes, sir. Fleet ready. Weirdly, my navy doesn't start off with any command. Once again, little tiny things like this. I wouldn't have released uh, my mod with all these little unfinished bits, but like I said, it is still in a beta-ish form, I suppose. I don't know. It needs some tweaking. My king. For instance, I don't have any Angsies on my main character. I have none. I don't have like a sword or a captain of the fleet or anything. I, there's loads of potential to uh, to add stuff to make the characters more diverse and everything, but it's just not here yet. Hopefully, you'll do that kind of stuff later on. Slow and steady. Fucking Boltons. Go away! No, you're not having it. Go away. The enemy Go has away. surrounded us. No. We are besieged. No, you're not. Oh well. If they take it, I'll just sack it again and get more money. If that's how you want to play it, Bolden, that's yes. how we'll play. An order, sire. Yes, sire. Yes. Marching, sire. We'll stop. Ah, son of a bitch. <laughs> Just out of range of my troop. We'll make camp here, sire. Bloody slavers. Okay. Uh, we'll put that guy there, and then he can stay where he is. Can that slaver defeat? No, he cannot. These gentlemen will probably swing over and go take Widow's Watch. I suppose. May as well send the slavers over there with that guy. Why not? 
Oh well. We may lose Widow's Watch, but like we said, we'll take it back and then we'll sack it again. <laughs> For what it's worth. Humphrey Sunderland. Um, I am absolutely... Okay, once again. Why has my, what, like, brother got the Lord of Sunderland thing when the faction leader doesn't? Little tiny things like that really need to be done for the mod. My lord. Sire, by your command. But anyway, we'll send those guys over that way and he can deal with them no for more, now. My lord. An order. Uh, what have we got here? Just Order. these slavers can join up with these gentlemen. Armies, my lord. Move. I've tried How many Stark? Fuck me, that's a large, large pile of Starks. My lord. Uh, send that guy back down the Wolf's Den for now, actually. Fleet ready, sire. Yes, sir. Leave those idiots at Sisterton. If we can deal with them later. This half a stack will land and bugger up Widow's Watch and probably sail around and fuck up Carhold and the other areas around there. We will eventually when we're a bit more in the green because we're about to go into debt. We'll send a fleet or two towards the Vale. Try to avoid being at war with the Starks for now. But if we can destroy Bolton then we can then turn our attentions to dealing with the... Uh, the, the, the <laughs> okay, that's a lot of Starks. And they're laying siege to my stuff. I may let them take it, and then I'll deal with them. My king, marching, sir. Yeah, I'll let them face the Boltons for now, and yes. uh... fleet ready, sire. Set sail. Let them face with the Boltons. Weaken their numbers by killing each other, and then we'll swoop in to uh, kill whoever the hell's victorious in their little fight. But uh, as it stands, looking at the flags alone, Bolton can easily sally out and kill that Stark. No, never mind. <laughs> if I was in a hot seat, that guy, Stark unit there, would have got himself killed. But uh, evidently not. There's another thing. The portraits you've like seen before as well, and different characters and everything. They're, they're all like similar... Like you can tell what they are. A fine day to sail. So that one was uh, the Bolton guy that cut off Jamie's hand in the HBO show, was I? Yes, sir. Yes. Uh, I'm trying to think if we should kill the Starks, or maybe we should get an alliance with the Starks and not worry about going any too further into the north. Yeah, fuck it. As you command, we'll return to our land, see if we can't get an alliance for the Starks. Just focus on dealing with Bolton for now. Maybe marry one of my... I don't know, my heir is married, isn't he? Because I married him off. Yeah, I did. That's annoying. Probably shouldn't have done that. Oh, well. But, eh, I don't know. I don't know if I trust the AI now, is to be honest. But yeah, that uh, army will go into the Vale while this, these guys get dropped off and uh, head towards the Dreadfort. Hopefully, my faction leader has a decent... Authority. I didn't have a look. If not, then this captain unit might fucking rout, which is not really what we want. Yeah, he doesn't really... For, for like, a dread 10-star general, he does not have a lot of authority. Which is weird to me, but, uh... Ships right. ready. A fine day to sail. Leaving the boat, sire. Sire. Yes. Hmm. It may have been better to stay on the ships and take car hold. Wait for the Stark idiots to come and uh, attack that area. Marching, sir. I sire. Fleet ready, sire. Oh, we'll send the main fleet back down here to pick up the king, and hopefully, uh, I'll probably get attacked by the Boltons, and then we can retreat back to my ship. I'm hoping. Should have landed there. If it was a hot seat, I would have just reloaded. Okay, no, we have not been attacked by the Boltons. Cowards! <laughs> it looks like the Umbers have actually taken car hold. No, Giant's Claw. I don't actually think there is car hold in the game yet. Uh, the Boltons are allied with House Dustin, and the Starks are allied with Umber, so I don't think we'll do too much. Your will, sir. Right. Now I will not 
mock you. I simply challenge you. Joining the fleet, sir. Uh, I don't imagine we want to attack them. Okay, let's uh, cancel our invasion plan of the north. We'll just keep yes, the coastline over here and uh, yes. stick with that. Command me, sir. Invasion force set sail. So those guys over there, join up with the other fleet. We're probably going through an immense amount of debt before we get everything done. But what we're going to do is sail around and attack Gold Town and the uh, city ports over there. That should get us an abundance of coin. Some of you are no doubt saying, take the north. But I kind of like the idea of just controlling that one section of the north and then all of the Vale. Rather than just, you know, spending my entire time in the north. I took the north as Umber in a, in a stream, so I don't really... Relish the idea of doing all that again. A fine day to sail. Fleet ready, sire. Yes, sir. Full sails. See, my prince sucks, and he's got barely any loyalty. The trains really need an overhaul on this mod. A lot of false Sunderlands that you can break from. It's weird. Why can't I go in that bit of sea there as well? A fine day to sail. Ships ready. I can't go around. You have to go all the way around here. Set sail. I suppose actually that makes it a lot easier to defend the north if you've just got this little straight bit of land here to defend. Because I suppose that's like deep ocean really around here and everything. But then again, we have a fleet. It's going to sail wherever the hell it wants. It's not going to be restricted to... It might be safer to go around here to avoid pirates, but... Uh, which I suppose fits for this time period, but you never know. I don't know. It's, it's just like, really? Do I have to go all the way around? <laughs> I don't want to... But yeah, hopefully the Starks uh, are too busy with the Boltons and everything to bother with dealing with me. Ships ready. Yes, aye, sire. And I think I can go right through this bit of land here that is non-existent. A fine day to sail. Which is kind of funny. Yes, an order. Yeah, uh, we'll see what they do for Cold War. I'll leave it where it is for now, and uh, Ships slowly ready. sail around. We are going into debt. Slowly and surely, but, uh... Hey, look at the stocks. Ask me for an alliance. Or is it just going to do that gay thing where the diplomat does the animation for asking you for something, but doesn't actually yet? Which means you're trying to bribe the settlement, or they plan to attack, usually. Do you... Do you... Do you... Handley has declared war on Darkling. We've got a new family member. Has he fixed the aging process yet? Yes, he has. That's, uh... It, it's still fucking taking forever. Uh, keep it in mind, like, a hot seat maybe can last, like, 50 turns is a long time for a hot seat. Because there's so much more thought and effort put into every single turn, uh, things take uh, move a lot slower, kind of thing. It doesn't take 200 turns to complete an entire campaign. So, yeah, 15 turns could take a couple of months, and that kid's only four years old, so... yeah, I think the aging for the Age of Petty Kingdoms is probably the best... Uh, aging thing that there is. Yeah, send those guys forward. I, I never like sailing. Probably take cold water. My king. Yes, sire. Moving because we to can. crush the enemy. Killing his Besieging little general. The cowards, Slightly worried about the other ship because it's so small and pathetic that it's probably going to get crushed by some kind of Veilman fleet. That and the north is undefended right now, and there's a Stark armies up there that could quite easily attack my shit. Or Dustin armies that could quite like, easily attack my shit. <laughs> Hi, Dustin! I hate you, Dustin, you fucking prick. I shall return north one day to destroy you. Uh -oh. Can you not tell, friend, from ships ready? Disembarking, sire. Your will, sire. 
to war then, sire. Beginning the siege, sire. The siege. I sire. Yes, well. Sir. Yes. We may have to postpone our uh, plan of taking so much land in the Vale. Victory! Ships ready. We might have to sail back north and attack these idiots. I sire. For now, however, Set sail. we fucking deal with this. And what? And to board. The fuck you say? The fuck you say? How how the hell Sire, did that work? We should disengage. The enemy I, I had no twice mercy. as much of their ships. We'll drop Reloading. Morning, <laughs> I'm sorry. What? How how how, how did that work? Ooh. Okay, a Sunderland ship's really shit or something? And they're like the opposite in the of the Ironborn Ord Resolve. <laughs> the Ironborn Ord Resolve for naval battles is like incredibly OP and they always fucking win. So I imagine Sunderland being the liable Ironborn of the uh, of the East, they apparently have really shit auto resolve. Yes, sir. I lost Moving one guy that time. No! No, my luck, it was the king. <laughs> Nothing can stop us, sire. Ah, but stop winning. The settlement fleet ready, okay, I got sire. fucking one galley, two galley, three galley, four galley, fucking five galley, and a merchant ship. Right. He has three galleys. An enemy ship. Ships ready. Is that what we're, what, what we're we're discussing here? Is it? Leaving the boat, sire. Sire, marching to war, laying siege, sire. Aye, sire. Set sail. A fine day to okay. Ready. We're going to go back over here now, game. Set We're not going to do anything real stupid like. Can you not tell friends okay, he, he's got a war guy. Oh, crap. Okay, that might be war. Why? I find it hard to imagine, however, that just because he's got one fucking war galley, it means that all of mine are completely useless. So, uh, we'll, we'll all resolve again. Because we can't have any other fucking option. It's one to one, but average victory. Ship sunk one ship and all of mine are remaining. Eh, that'll do, but now I feel incredibly endangered. <laughs> I do not feel safe now, ladies and gentlemen. Not at all. Oh, well, at least we're going back into the green now. We're laying siege to Longbow Hall, so that'll be dead pretty soon. Gonna wipe out Hunter, whose helmet is far too big for his head. We're going to lose Wolf's Den, unfortunately. Or not, because the AI is incredibly fucking stupid. <laughs> Honestly, every time I think the AI has done something smart, I get corrected in the fact that they're just really fucking dumb. Take out Longbow Hall. I'll have five grand from that. Thank you very much. We are apparently English uh, raiders. Ships ready. Leave the slavers there. And these guys can come around here and fuck these up. If I was really interested in getting as much cash as possible, I would have sent this guy. But he's got zero lo loyalty. Mainly because he's got 10% plus looting. But once again, the zero loyalty sort of makes him completely and utterly fucking useless. The reason he has zero loyalty... Um... Is because they forgot to put the um hmm. the reason they have zero loyalty is because they forgot to put the loyalty starter train into the section. You can't actually see the loyalty starter train, it's like an invisible one, kind of, but it's uh still there. I'm gonna build myself a diplomat quick. And probably start to build uh Hi, sire. Let's try to build some bloody more ships. Holy crap, that's a large stack of irons. Large stack of irons. No. Faction is destroyed. House Bolton's dead. Which is bad news for me because <laughs> now the Starks don't have anyone else to fight. Set sail. Okay, can we please get a bit closer to the land without, uh... Aye, sire. Leaving the fleet. 
Fleet ready, sire. Aye, sire. Here we go. Set sail. Okay, they've got Set some ready. decently large-sized fucking armies at Runestone. Fleet ready, sire. Joining the fleet, sire. Um. Hmm. This could be problematic, ladies and gentlemen. Can we put a fort there? I think it's too close to the. Uh... Yeah, too close to that bridge to make a fort there, which sucks. Oh well. I can't recruit anything there yet because, well, you know. <laughs> mm. Well, landing in this place is not a option while there's a like a giant stack of runestone. Thankfully, the AI is really stupid and the Dustins are fucked off. Your orders, sire. I'll move those idiots over here, however. Begin the recruitment of some of my guys. Mainly just these dudes. Oh, next turn. Hopefully the Starks accept my alliance, because they've killed the Boltons now, which means... Ah, that... Well, that they no longer have anyone else to attack, other than the Dustins, I imagine, so... They're a potential threat again. Well, they were always a potential threat. All right. What I'm about to do is incredibly stupid, and I don't recommend it to anybody else. <laughs> which is just sailing down into the black water to try and steal some ship without getting sunk by enemy ships. Which I will almost certainly get sunk by enemy ships. It's also probably a really bad idea for me to have both my uh, faction leader and everyone else. I just noticed what they're drown god. Why are they drown god? Is this more of the false <laughs> made-up law that Fawn's put into this mod? <sighs> He's made up some law for House Hoar as well, making them Andals, because he thinks that they were... <laughs> it sounded right or something, he said. It doesn't sound right. It's, it's wrong. It's just wrong. Most of my opinion, but, uh, yeah. When I make up law, I try to make it sound, you know, legit. And the Ironborn being seven, and then getting conquered, and then voting the Andals... It doesn't, doesn't make sense. <laughs> the whole R story that he's made up just doesn't make sense at all to me. Uh, I forgot to contact the Starks for my diplomat, didn't I? Winter is here. <clears throat> Who knows? Summer is here at the same time. <laughs> hey, it's Sunderland. Donald Sunderland. Uh, I might get that guy, actually. He's not half bad. Fuck it. Fleet ready, sire. Yes, sir. Full sails. A fine day to sail. We are not here to contest these waters with you. <laughs> Ships ready. Fuck it, why not? Moving ashore, sire. Damn. <laughs> ready, sire. Didn't mean to do that. And these why Macy guys have a lot the of ships. No I'm fucking screwed. <laughs> really, really screwed. Yep. That fleet is going to get fucking owned. Ships ready. Okay, let's see if we can't hide Let's them say. from the AI because the AI is really fucking stupid. Hopefully I can still take that castle, but it's not going to be of much use to me when my ships get destroyed. Before we end the turn and forget to do what I fucking set out to do. Your Majesty, what plan do you bring to my people? Uh-huh. Is this going to be one of those mods where I can't get the AI to agree to shit because they all are incredibly negative? You would yeah, it's going to be one of those fucking mods. <laughs> My lord. What's the point of a fucking diplomat when all of the AI is just going to refuse everything you fucking offer them? My liege. Your will, sir. Oh well, let's go next turn. Probably get that fleet kill, but at least we'll take Blackstone and I guess. Then again, we are neutral. Oh look, Starks. Lots of Starks. 